Good morning, Penny. How are you? And it's been a very busy day for me so far. What's it been like for you so far? Has it been a good one? A good start to the day? Well, here, it's actually very dreary outside, very rainy weather. But I had an early start. I had to take Milo to the groomers with my daughter. And Milo is going to get a nice haircut for the winter months. And uh, so he looks nice and smart through November and December. And then I've come back and I've been editing yesterday's video. And then it's uh, time to do a voiceover actually for a client. So I can't record that in video segment because, um, well, I just can't. That's for the client's ears and eyes only. And then on with the rest of the day. I hope you all have a good one actually. Uh, let me know what you're getting up to. Milo, have you had a haircut? Have you? Have you had a haircut? Hmm? Ooh, looking smart. So I thought I'd bring Penny out on a little drive. Actually running some errands at the moment. And I think actually, Penny, it's the first time you have been in the Mini, is it not? I think it is. Anyway, what am I up to? Well, basically, the uh, rain is still coming down. Still very, very dreary day. But I've had to pop out to drop some packages and parcels off. Normally, when I'm sending things back, couriers come to me. But sometimes it's just easier to drop some of them off at various pickup points. It just basically means that I don't get couriers disturbing me whilst I'm recording. And I've got a video to record this afternoon, another unboxing. So I thought it was easier for me to just drop these packages off, take me about 15, 20 minutes round trip, and then I can get on with the recording for the rest of the day. Talking of packages though, one of them is a return. And I think I have moaned about Amazon before, but I want to give them credit where credit's due, because I order a lot of stuff from Amazon, and Amazon are fantastic for various reasons. One of the reasons is because they sell pretty much everything. Another reason is because I've got Prime membership. And for that, I think it's pretty good value for money. I pay a fixed £49 for a whole year. And um, that £49 gets me free next day delivery on products that are actually stocked by Amazon. Not that, that are marketplace sellers, but actual Amazon products or Amazon stock, I should say. And I think that's fantastic. So they do next day delivery on pretty much anything that I order. And then the other reason I want to give them credit is because when you have to return something, like I am today, and I can't tell you what it is because it's part of my new studio equipment and I'm going to be recording that studio tour very, very soon. But one of the products came through and it was slightly warped. So it wasn't quite suitable for what I needed so I do need to send that one back and that is in the boot of my car at the moment and I'm going to drop that off at a local pickup point uh, because it just speeds up the replacement it means probably that they will already send the replacement out today and the replacement will be with me tomorrow I think that is just fantastic service and going back to this Prime membership I'd be really interested to know if any of you guys and girls have got Prime membership as well, because I think it's very, very good value for money. I, yeah, £49 is a lot to pay, but if you're going to order, say, maybe, I would say a dozen, which is 12, for those of you who don't know, but a dozen or more things in a year, that's only sort of £4 per item for next day delivery. I think that's pretty darn good. I think, in fact, I think that is a very good value for money especially when you consider you could order quite a large item and it's still come next day totally free. So really, really pleased with that. So I hope you're enjoying the little drive with me. I know Penny's enjoying it. She's sitting here on a new little suction mount that I've actually mounted to the speedometer on my Mini. And my Mini's got two speedometers. It's got one in front of me here, a digital one, and also like an analog type one. So even though she's sitting stuck to that uh, other speedometer, I can still see the speed that I'm doing. And at the moment, it's 29 miles per hour. So within the speed limit, I always drive as sensibly as I can. 
and uh, ugh, I'm actually driving past the sea at the moment and you can't even see the horizon. It is very, very murky out there. As you can see from my glasses, I'm totally steamed up because I got drenched when I had to get out of the car. But I'm now on my way back to the studio to do my recording for this afternoon. And I thought I would take a more scenic route back to the studio because I absolutely hate sort of driving in a straight line and then driving back the same way because I get a little bit bored doing that. So I tend, when I'm doing these drives, to do a circular route. So set off in one direction and come back around a different route just to keep me entertained. And this road I'm driving up now is really beautiful when it's sunny. It's got some fantastic scenery and absolutely gorgeous trees. But I'm not going to show you today because I'm having to concentrate on the driving because the weather is absolutely appalling so I'm really having to concentrate. I probably won't record. Hey, he should have let me go. Just had somebody just pull straight out. Some of these drivers, man. Parked car on the opposite side of the road and he just came straight out in front of me. Unbelievable, some drivers. I, I really do think they should bring back having to retake your test every maybe 10 or 15 years. I think that would be a really good idea. I wouldn't mind doing it. If I failed, I failed, but I would still retake it just to check that my uh, driving ability is still up to scratch. But anyway, I digress. I was saying that I was having to concentrate really hard on driving, so I can't show you the scenery outside. I'll wait till the weather's better and then I will share the scenery on my route back to the studio with you. So, in closing today's video, I just hope that Penny has enjoyed the ride and that you've enjoyed the ride too. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you.